All right, so with the new clicker sim update, with the 460 mil event coming out, that leaves another question again, once again, you know, which egg should you guys be grinding in the game? Should it be the 460 million event or the last update's egg, the toxic egg? And I'm gonna be answering that for you guys today to show you guys which egg you should actually be focusing on. So let's probably start off with the limited egg. So starting off with the limited egg, it is a limited egg, of course. It's an event egg, and it comes with two legendaries, a divine, and a pretty hard secret pet. And this is only gonna be in the game for seven days. So because it's unlimited, you know, it's gonna be on a timestamp, and that timestamp is seven days, of course, like I just said. So should you be grinding it? It depends. Because this egg is gonna give you tons of like i guess value like pet value if you guys did not know there's a trading economy in the game where you guys could trade pets and limited pets tend to go for much more so if you can get like the divines like rainbows and goldens of the divines that can give you some pretty good value or even if you get the secret pet that's also going to give you some pretty insane value but the stats for getting the pets are not that worth it i would say it does take a pretty long time to get the legendaries and the divines and for the stats it's really not the best so if you're looking for value then i mean go for it but if you're looking for stats don't do it it's just really not worth it and i'm gonna get into the toxic egg and explain you guys the pros and cons of that All right, so with the toxic egg, you're gonna actually get tons of pretty OP stats that are actually not too hard to hatch, especially if you have game passes. It shouldn't be too hard to actually like get these pets. The only bad thing is these pets will not hold a value. They won't hold value because it's not a limited egg. It is a permanent egg, which means it will be in the game forever. For example, all these islands, have limited eggs or not limited permanent eggs and these permanent eggs will never leave the game like for let's say dark fantasy dark fantasy this egg will be in the game forever it's never leaving which is why the value on that egg is pretty bad it's because there is no value on that egg because once an update comes out the value for that egg is gone it goes poof goodbye no more value so you know, it's kind of like, it's kind of weird. Cause even if you did get the secret, the secrets don't hold much value because they're permanent, but you will get pretty good stats. So, I mean, it's kind of a trade off, I guess. So in conclusion, I, it's kind of mixed both ways. If you do want limited pets and want to get value, grind the limited egg, you know? But, 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 there's a big but. It's gonna be pretty hard to get, you know, a ton of like stat pets from that egg as the rarity is pretty hard. So I would recommend if you wanted stats, to go ahead and hatch the permanent egg, the newest permanent egg, at, which is the toxic egg. As of right now, you know, as the video being recorded, it'd be the toxic egg. I'd recommend going ahead and grinding that if you wanted stats and don't really care too much about value. Cause that's gonna give you the most stats and it's gonna be way easier to get those stat pets. And to be honest, it's not even really that big of a difference. But that's basically gonna be it for the video guys if i did help you out you know in any way shape or form and you do enjoy my content you could always subscribe because you know we're on, i'm on the road to 1k and i want to hit it please help me hit it you know and i'll see you guys in my next video peace